What up, Long Beach? Welcome back to your home for everything local sports. It's Paul, and this high school girls basketball video is brought to you by Naples Rib Company, the perfect place to cater your team's next event, and they've been doing it for over 30 years. We're going all the way out, all the way out to Rancho Cucamonga, Milliken at Etiwanda Open Division Girls Basketball, the best of the best. The Etiwanda Eagles are no joke. The two seed in the bracket, 24-1 overall so far this season. But the Rams have Tyler Frierson, the Wright State signee, a legit 6'4", putting up eye-popping numbers this season. They'll make you double take. Rams big underdogs in this one, but don't tell them that. They came out swinging from the opening tip. Etiwanda not quite ready for the Rams' fire early in the game and did not know what to do with Frierson inside. Priscilla Blanco takes the dribble drive, creates space for Frierson, who lays it up and in. Milliken led 6-2. In the early going as Cassie Gonzalez hits the pull-up J from the charity stripe. But the Eagles would respond by also getting the ball inside. Layla Orgy goes right at Frierson. She has to stay out of foul trouble, so she has to be cautious. And off the miss, I mean, if we're playing 21 tip, that's going back to zero. Michaela Wilson with the putback. Not sure how that went in, but Etiwanda led 13-9 after one. Etiwanda got three quick buckets in the second quarter to extend the lead a bit off the steal. Evan Turner, I'm guessing no relation, with the bucket. And off the inbound orgy again, showing off the mid-range game to go up by 11. But the Rams would hang tough in this. They kept up with Etiwanda. They sped up the pace, forced the Eagles to take bad shots, leading to easy layups and transition. One from Emily Newkirk, and then one from Tyler Frierson from Tani Estencio's feed. And then off the inbound, late in the first half, Reese Kafinko finds Shaylee Wright. And I mean, that's too easy. The Rams are in this thing now. They're down by eight, heading into halftime. But in the third quarter, the Etiwanda shot selection was better, and they began to knock down open looks. Wilson gets the shooter's roll. Skip pass to Hamilton. It's all about the Hamiltons, baby. Etiwanda outscored Milliken 20 to 12 in the third and went on a 10-2 run to close out the quarter. Kafinko rattles home a three. Bank is open in Rancho Cucamonga, I guess, but the Rams still trailed 46-30 heading into the fourth quarter. Turner took over in the fourth for Etiwanda. I mean, she's legit. Only a sophomore. She had 12 points for the Eagles. Three different players. We're in double figures for Etiwanda. Game got out of hand a bit in the fourth for Milliken, but Tyler Frierson, let me tell you, is a beast, plain and simple. I mean, the way she fights for boards and position inside, I mean, it's, it's just remarkable. Not once, but two opportunities for that put back. And then a great pass from Kafinko. Frierson with another double-double. Led all players with 21 points and 22 rebounds. Yes, you heard that right. But this was Etiwanda's night. Wilson with the scoop shot, and the Eagles take it 63-42. Kind of ran away with it late in this one. Some good things for Milliken, though. Etiwanda advances to play Sarah in the quarters, while Milliken plays Fairmont Prep on Wednesday, already having secured a CIF state, state playoff spot. Thanks to all of our sponsors, including Papa Lucci's, a great place to eat on Second Streets. We still have a lot of CIF Southern Section basketball coverage here and you know where to get your coverage it's gazettesports.com and the press telegram